Hello everyone guys, this is Dipendra Kumar Brahma from Assam, Northeast India. Right now I'm standing in front of our university. This is the main entrance from where we can enter inside our university. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how I came to this university and why did I came and also the university, how is it from inside. So let's get started. So as you guys can see behind me, the students are checking the temperature. If your temperature is not normal, they will send you back at home. And if your temperature is fine, then you can enter the university. Today mine is fine, so I'm going inside the university. So this is the place where you have to keep your jackets and after keeping your jackets, you will get a token like this. So that you will get back your jacket whenever you want it. So this is the place where you can keep the jacket before entering the center. So after entering the university, as soon as you give the jacket, you will see a small canteen out here. We have actually three canteens and this is the first one which you will see. Here you can have coffee, tea and bread or anything you want. But in order to fill your stomach completely, you have to go to the different canteen. There are two more canteens in our university which I will show you guys further ahead in this vlog. The reason why I came to this university is that it is completely English medium till the sixth year and the faculties here are really amazing and there are also NMS students who has already graduated from our university and currently practicing in India after completion of the MBBS from our university. That is the very reason why I came to this university. So this is one of the classroom as you guys can see right now there are no students because of the COVID-19 so I'm here to show you guys and I also tell you about the studies here how is it actually so first of all I'd like to tell you guys that uh, we have different subjects and per day we have uh, at least three to four subjects and the classes starts from 8.30 till 5.30 or 6 o'clock maybe. It depends on the schedule which you have. Maybe in a day you might have only two subjects. So during the subject hours you, you will be having breaks for around 15 to 20 minutes. So it depends actually on the subject. So during your class hours you might also have lecture in between like if your classes start from 8.30 first class and then it ends in the maybe 9.30 or 10 o'clock then you'll be having lecture from maybe 10.30. So it depends sometimes the lecture may be in between or maybe at the beginning itself maybe 8.30. So it depends. Uh, it depends on the schedule. So this is actually a classroom and lecture won't be happening in this classroom. Lecture will be happening in the auditorium. So this is just a classroom where students of maybe a group of maybe 12 or 13 students will be sitting here. So some of you guys must be having doubt how the exams are conducted here. So I'd like to tell you guys that uh, if you want to sit in the main exam, you have to attend each and every class. So every class you will be given some task by the teacher. Suppose uh, if the teacher teaches you some topic today, then in the next class you will have to clear that topic. I mean you will have to complete the task that, has, that the teacher has given to you. So if you complete all the tasks by the end of the semester, teacher will be giving you a signature on your credit book. And that signature is also known as the credit. So if you... Uh, complete all the tasks and if you get the credit for every subject then only you will be eligible to sit in the main exam so in order to sit in the main exam you have to complete every task you have to get a credit from every teacher then only you will be able to sit in the main exam so right now i'm here in the fourth floor so this is the place where our lecture used to be as you guys already know that because of the covid 19 our classes are going on online in the moodle and it's closed so now i can't go inside and i have something interesting to show you guys so this is a model of Sambrin. I don't know actually what is it. So there are a lot of portraits of the ships and everything. So I, they have depicted on the walls to show about the history of Arkhangelsk. So right now I'm here in the corridor of the ground floor. As you can see behind me there are numerous notice boards where you will be updated with a lot of information. And here is our Dean's office. In this ground floor you will find uh, Dean's office of the various faculties. We have total 18 faculties here. Now because of the COVID situation, the, all the information that, that need to be informed is updated online. So now we will see the next part of our university. So 
so this is our university polyclinic which is situated inside our university so if you are sick first you have to come here if you want to take a leave from your class and this is our policy card so first you need to get this and then you can go inside this and then you will uh, and you will have to consult a doctor so they will give you a certificate uh, denoting that if you are really sick and then only you can take the leave so without any medical reason you can leave your classes so if you leave your classes then you will have to face consequences while getting your credit so getting credit is very important as you guys already know in order to sit in the main exam this is our sports hall where you can play volleyball basketball badminton and many other sports as you can see it's really very very big and i'll show you guys around so before entering this uh, sports hall you have to change your dress so i mean you have to bring your lower or maybe some sports shoes before entering to this place It's really big and I hope you guys like our sports. So let's see what happens next. So as I have told you guys that we have three canteens and this is second canteen and there is one more premium canteen inside. So right now it's really noisy. I can't go inside and people are having food and everything. So whenever you feel hungry you can come to this canteen you will find rice, beef, chicken, egg, everything whatever you want to have. You will find pastry juice everything whatever you want so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and this is how our university looks and i have shown you guys only the small portion of our university i hope you guys like this video so in future we'll come up with the more videos so until then please wear mask and see you guys in the next video thank you